Every generation has a legend. Star Wars is home to more than one, and I'm thrilled to invite a couple of them to join me on the stage today. The first is someone we are so fortunate to have as our Yoda of the Star Wars today, Kathy Kennedy, president of Lucasfilm, and, and producer of every Star Wars film <clears throat> we've done at Disney. Powerful she is. Please welcome, and wait, when we have joining her filmmaker extraordinaire, and the writer-director of Star Wars, The Rise of Skywalker. And of course, The Force Awakens, J.J. Abrams. Abram. Yay, please welcome Kathy and J.J. One of the great experiences that we had on this movie was, of course, working with our incredible cast. Let's meet them now. Daisy Ridley. John Boyega. Oscar Isaac. Kelly Marie Tran. Yano Sotamo. Naomi Aki. Harry Russell. Anthony Daniels. And Billy Dee Williams. What's up? She was good And BB-8, R2-D2, and Dio. <laughs> Hello, D23. What's going on? <laughs> uh, well, my second time here, and it was uh, it was as much fun as last time. I got to say, you know, the the fans who come out for this stuff. Um, bring an incredible energy that is uh, it's sort of especially when you're working in post and you're in an editing room all the time all day to come out and hear the kind of roar of that crowd it reminds you why you're doing it you know you, you just you, you cannot take for granted anything and so anytime there is enthusiasm for uh, something that you're working on especially something like Star Wars which is so much bigger than all of us um, you know it's uh, again it's something that we're just nothing but grateful for it was very exciting because I knew what was going to happen at the end of the teaser. And obviously the filmmakers did, but no one else did. So I was like, dun, 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 dun. And then the reaction of the crowd was awesome. So that's been a real lift. Um, the whole experience has been so fantastic anyway, but I think like the, the little teaser we've had and this today is just really helping with the, the like excitement for it. Yeah, and it's fun because, you know, it's not just Star Wars today. It's all the Disney films. So it's really nice being part of... Uh, like the whole thing, the whole Disney roster. And there's so much cool stuff that's coming out and I've seen so many people like Anthony and Jelly, oh my God. It's, uh, it's great. Look, I feel good. This is, for me, it's just like a, a massive thing and, and, and to be here with the fans in collaboration with my colleagues and having JJ come down, see Kathy, Alan Horn, everyone. It just, just goes to show it's a, a big group of people who are really dedicated to this franchise and who want you to love it. Listen, listen, you know, Finn, 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 Finn has some swagger, you know, I don't know who done his hair, but he got his twist done, line up, high boots, blue pants, a vest. Let's just say I felt very Star Wars in this one. I mean, you, you feel it from when you go to D23 to when you meet somebody on the streets and where you watch the trailer yourself and you feel it, you feel that energy and it's appreciated because, you know, you, you could be a part of something that's not really um, accepted by the fans and it's, their choice is what's powerful and, and so for us to, for them to choose this is, is dope but for me to be a part of what they've chosen and this franchise you know, I can't I can't complain. Power has kind of been this this one very important mode for the for the trilogy so far and then in this I remember when JJ said I kind of want to dirty up his image a little bit and kind of show that the, the, his past there was a little bit of a kind of a shady past and in comes Zori. In dun, 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 dun. Amazing costume ever. <laughs> kind of like a religious experience out there is such a frenzy and people are so excited and I think once once you really start seeing that this is the culmination of the entire Skywalker saga it just you know it gets people pretty amped up it's amazing I mean 
listen, and you're even for us, we're backstage, and all these actors from all these different cool giant movies are back there, and um, it's fun. It's really exciting. Um, I mean, the uh, energy from the crowd was just amazing to see. I didn't know. I didn't know how many people were going to be out there, and it was the the whole whole room was packed, and it was uh, really exciting to show uh, the t the sizzle reel to the fans and and talk about the movie a little bit, and and uh, it was amazing. Yeah, that's that's the when when you're working in film, you don't you know you don't feel the uh, the love from the audience is on on set that day, but afterwards when the film is edited and you get the trailers. Then you get to feel the love. Then you get to see what impact the film is probably going to have. And, and uh, for this film, I'm really excited to to finally see this myself and uh, to have the world see what we've done. And I can't wait. Oh, I'm so excited. It was so cool to be in that room and feel that energy and feel how much people love this thing that we get to be a part of. Um, I'm really excited for people to see what JJ has like cooked up. I think it's pretty incredible. I think truly because it's such a culmination of everything that Disney is about. I mean, that's a word that people automatically go to an image when they hear that word. Um, but Disney has been, since the beginning, really good about incredible storytelling. And um, I think it's really cool that we get to share our incredible story here. So yeah. Yeah, this is, this is my first E23. What a welcome. I'm insanely excited. I I didn't expect so many um, so much footage to be shown. Um, it's pretty emotional. I was watching at the same time as everyone else, which is great. Um, yeah, it's crazy cool. It's so cool. Yeah, it's a family, man, and we're we're all up there together, and we all support each other. And I am so happy that they are the people who they are, and that we get to do this together. It makes this stuff so much more fun. I know the thought of having little girls dressed up as Jana and boys dressed up as Jana makes me so happy. I know it's cool. Halloween costumes, bring them on! I love it. Yeah. When you are making a movie, the the fans aren't there. So uh, as the movie comes to to fruition, and it's going to open in a few weeks' time, um, suddenly you begin to share what you have secretly been doing all these months. And it feels so exciting. I mean, obviously, every, everybody says it feels so exciting to have that roar of, of welcome from the fans who are so enthused, whose energy has actually kept, for instance, the whole Star Wars thing running for 40-something years now. Without the fans, there, you know, there would have been one movie. And um, that energy, you know, with jet lag and whatever, you're going, oh, do I have to get up this early? Do I, ah. With that energy, you feed on it in a, in a good way. It's a kind of mutual thing. No, well, this is very, I didn't expect all of this, but uh, it's, uh, it's, it was uh, a very special, wonderful uh, surprise and experience. And working with JJ was uh, one of the highlights of my, uh, my career. I've been doing this for 60 years, and uh, working with this, this young man is uh, a blessing.